What's up guys, Lemon here. And Mushroom with the Knifers Playbook episode for Mutiny, part of the DLC Invasion. This is the map series where we break it down and look through a bit of the spawn routes. Um, the first thing we do is the spawn routes for the flanking. A search bomb A and bomb B spot, a domination spot, and then a camper bank shot. So kicking it off with the fed spawn, um, we're actually going to be running around, pretty much running the whole outside left side of the map here. Throwing a stun through there because they will come up onto that spawn there. You might be able to see people up those stairs there. And then ducking through here because no one chooses to go this way I've started to notice while playing this map. Um, some people may still be in the hangman's area there um, if, they, if they're still hanging out. But if not, they'll be up here in part, uh, part of that spot there which is going to be our camper spot a bit later on. But then also come up on the boat here and check it out. For the ghost side, you want to spawn and push right into this room where Mushroom knows there's no people in here. So once you've headed through here, this is kind of like the under part of the map. You come out near the ship, just check your right there and you can maybe slide across just so they don't shoot you there. Um, check your right there again and just head up onto the boat and you'll probably find people that have already pushed up onto the boat ready to like take out those spawn snipes. So, uh, and then just move on from there. Now the A-bomb is pretty cool, it's on the boat here and you want to park yourself right on the edge of the bomb there. Running around into this little nook in the very back of the map. Um, there is a push-in spot which is nice and easy and then this is one of the nicest uh, bank spots we've come up with. It's just so easy, it's at the top of the flagpole there that you can see or uh, mast if you want on the ship and it, you just move forward as you're throwing it and it goes perfectly over to the spot there. The next one on the B-bomb is kind of similar, you want to plant on this side of the bomb here and once you've done that you want to head over to the hangman area. Um, this one is cool because you lean out from these poles so you want to push in as far as you can into them and then lean out using that lean feature. You want to put the top point of your throwing knife reticle just underneath that wooden bit there. You might want to put it up a little bit. I'd noticed that mine didn't quite reach on the first throw. Once you've done that, using strong arm for every shot in this KP today, guys. Um, it just does this awesome little triggle bank. It's so cool. It just misses the end of the, uh, the house there and then drops down and that's a really cool spot. Now this next bank on the domination flag spot for A is my favorite one out of this episode just because it goes off of this bell which makes a sound when you actually throw the throwing knife against it, which I don't know why that makes me so happy, but it does. You want to make sure that the throwing knife reticle is right in the middle there, so it just fills up the bell, and it's on the line of the bottom bell curve, um, and it just banks perfectly over to the, the flag spot there to take them out. These campers often camp behind this box, and if you come up onto the top part of this boat here, um, you can actually hide behind the little uh, the turning circle here and just bank it off. There's two notches on the actual um, steering wheel there. Off the bottom one using strong arm will just flick over and right on the side of it and it'll go down to those campers there. Turning circles are also called uh, steering wheels. Thank you. Did you yes. know that? There you go. Under pressure, I'm terrible. Yeah. So. Um, if you guys like that, we're gonna be probably doing them for all the invasion because it's, it's all right. Invasion. It's all right. Invasion's all right. It's all right. Apart from fucking departed. Awful.